Hey everyone, it's Kayak Cliff. Today I'm going to do a very quick video on how to install a camera mount to an inflatable kayak. And I have the Sea Eagle Fast Track here. I've already done this mount to my razor light. And what it requires is, well, really three products from Scotty. Scotty makes some unbelievable mounts to install to inflatable kayaks. Typically, if you have a plastic kayak, all you do is buy one of these deck mounting brackets. And there's four screws and you get your screw gun and screw it into the plastic and you're done, but <laughs> you're not screwing to uh, inflatables. So what you have to do instead, pick this up here, is Scotty makes a glue on pad for inflatable boats. And this will work for inflatable paddle boards, inflatable kayaks, whatnot. Um, the drop stitch floor in the fast track is awesome for this. You just need a smooth inflatable floor. And we're gonna glue this down. And there's actually four uh, threaded holes that I can then take this mounting bracket and lay it over and screw it into this mounting pad. So there's threaded holes so the screws don't go into your inflatable kayak. It works awesome. I've been using it for about a year on my razor light and I love it. So I'm gonna put one on here and basically this is the camera mount and it snaps into the base here and then the camera mount uh, adjusts and articulates up and down and around in all directions so you can get the best footage. It's got a GoPro mount uh, up on the front and then it's got a quarter 20 thread if you have a normal camera that you need to mount uh, via that method. So it's got two different ways to do it. Um, Scotty also makes, to go into this base, they make cup holders and rod holders as well. So I'll be putting the links for all these products in the description box at the end of the video, but hey, I'm gonna show you real quick how to install it. Okay, so they're out of the package now. This is the glue pad that we're gonna be gluing on, and there's the four holes on it. And this is the uh, mounting base or mounting bracket. And that's gonna screw in, and that's what's gonna be on the floor of your kayak, ready to receive rod holders, drink holders, or in my case, camera holders. So, what I'm gonna do is I typically bring these as far forward as I can and I orient them going bow to stern, kind of like lengthwise. I don't think there's any right or wrong on that. But uh, next you want to take an alcohol pad and you want to clean both surfaces thoroughly because we are going to be gluing these down. Get any oils or sand or grease or anything off of that off of that base there okay next you can take a, a sharpie marker and just draw around to outline where that base is uh, i've done that before but uh, this time i'm going to try it out with painter's tape uh, you just need to delineate where that is going so you know where to put your adhesive and uh, the only problem with the painter's tape is you kind of kind of have to block off the corners because otherwise you're going to be putting glue on the corners and that'll be all exposed and not covered by the pad so that's what i'm doing here and theoretically i should just be able to lift it right off after i'm done gluing so there that's about done okay now we're ready for the glue Okay, now, again from Sea Eagle, you can order this glue, but this is special PVC uh, inflatable boat repair glue. And um, I already have one open from when I installed the other one. So I'm gonna basically, I'm gonna squeeze as much of this as I can onto this pad. And I think I'm gonna need to get the other one open. 
So the next one, and that's open. Again, I'm gluing it on, and I put about that much on. Then what you're supposed to do is take a paintbrush and evenly work this around the pad. And I need to put a little bit more on there, but you want a nice even coat of adhesive on there. So that's all covered with adhesive. Now you're going to let this sit. And you're going to do the same thing to the hull of the boat. So I'm putting some on here. And I'm brushing it on. And... Again, you don't want a huge, thick amount of stuff on here. You want, you want to be able to spread it and get a nice, even layer. Now, those two need to dry, uh, or cure, uh, is what the glue manufacturer says. So you're going to let this cure, and the best way to let it cure is to um, uh, take a little blow dryer, which I do not have right now, but since I'm in Texas, I can just walk outside in the Texas sun and expose these and and let it cure <laughs> with that heat so anyway you're going to let these cure and then after they've cured we just basically stick them together like a sticker boom and it's done i told you this was easy okay everything's all been warmed up um it feels dry to the touch i uh, had it out inside outside and it was kissed by the texas summer sun <laughs> So it warmed up, but a blow dryer, you can do it as well. So I'm going to take both pads and I'm going to take it carefully, line it up with my markings or my tape, and then I'm going to press down. And now this is, this is an instant contact. This is basically, this PVC glue is like contact cement. So once it's hooked, once it's mounted, it's there for good. So you want to press it in all over. And really, after it's on, you want to heat it up with a hair dryer again. Or, you know, take it outside in the Texas sun if you're in Texas. <laughs> but uh, anyway, you want, you want to make sure you get a good contact. And firmly press down and work it in, in all corners. And then you're done. And then, you want, and then after you get it all fully pressed and warmed and everything, let this sit for 24 hours to fully cure. And then you can take your mounting plate, bracket, whatever they call this from Scotty, mount it down on there, screw it in. And again, your rod holders, camera holders, drink holders, done. Super easy. An awesome upgrade, and the link for the, all these products are available from Sea Eagle, and I will put them in the description box so you can click on them and do your own inflatables. So thanks for watching. Have a great one, and safe adventuring out there on the water.